Hello there, Rev. In accordance with the large celestial bodies being the only thing visible due to the fact that uh, there are many fires apparently wreaking havoc on air quality, uh, I decided to make this project in a way that would uh, directly show some of that aspect and is inspired directly in a way by the moon of the night that I actually uh, painted this on. But unfortunately, it only peeked through the clouds for a little bit. And uh, so the colors were actually decided on because of that uh, effect. Yeah, I think that's pretty good. I'm going to use some orange now. I think that's pretty good. See why it shows up better and I don't have to use as much is because I already put the base white layer first. That's true. Thank you. Alright, I'm just trying to, this gloss purple, it has... I'm guessing monk fruit for the uh, colorant, and so if you spray it right, you can get different colors. So I just want a quick spritz to try to give some color to the smaller moon and the bigger moon so that it looks all dynamic. So let's see here. Come in this way. There we go. Perfect. Alrighty. Whoops, I didn't. Yeah, whatever. There we go. I'm facing the moon area there. I think that looks really good, especially in the camera's perspective. 